Hello friends, in this lecture we will discuss how to convert context-free grammar to push-down automata. But before this, let us see what is context-free grammar and push-down automata. Context-free language Context-free language is nothing but a set of strings generated by context-free grammar. Grammar consists of four tuples that is N, D, P and S. N is the set of non-terminals, P is the set of terminals, P is the production rule, and S is the start symbol. Now, what is pushdown automata? Pushdown automata is a finite state machine attached with stack. PDA has an advantage over DFA, that is, DFA can remember a finite amount of info, but PDA can remember can remember an infinite amount of information and reason behind this is uses stack. Pushdown automata has seven tuples. They are q represents set of states, sigma represents the input symbols, tau represents the pushdown symbols. Those symbols which can be pushed in and pushed out of the stack. Delta is the transition function which governs the push and pop operation by reading the input symbol and the stack symbol. Q0 is the initial state, Z is the initial push down symbol which is present which is which presents initially in the stack. F is the set of final state. Now the question arises how can we convert CFG to PDA? That so the answer is there exists an equivalence relationship between CFG and PD. Here, grammars. Let us understand. Let us understand how to convert context-free grammar to push-down automata. For this, consider G as a context-free grammar <coughs> having four tuples N, T, P, and S. We have to convert this grammar into a PD by a set of two rules. Rule means states delta function of del of Q comma epsilon comma A equals to q comma s where a derives s and epsilon is the no input symbol according to rule 2 del of q comma a comma a equals to q comma epsilon where the top of the stack and the input symbol are same then according to this we can pop out the top element from the stack now let us See the implementation of these two rules to an example. Question Construct a PDA which is equivalent to the following CFG. For constructing a PDA out of a CFG, first of all, we will need to define all the tuples of PDA, then we have to derive all the delta functions according to rule 1 and rule 2. This will help us out in making the table. Initially stack was empty, then a start symbol gets into the stack and st S derives itself as ASA according to the first transition. Now the top of the stack and the first input symbol both are the same then A will get pop out of the stack and S will derive itself as SBS according to transition 2. Now both B are same, hence B will pop out. S will derive itself as S will derive itself as BSB. Now B will pop get popped out of the stack here and change its states to q1. After every popping out of an element from the stack, the state will get changed. Similarly, s will derive itself as c. Here also the state gets changed to q3 and c will pop out in the similar way at last both these strings are null and hence we can say that uh, the language was context-free language and was accepted by push-down automata.